Hi, my name is Carrie Krieger. I am going to teach you how to play the bamboo flute. And my flute website is indianflutemusic.com, so definitely go check that out. Go check out savethefrogs.com as well. So, what I want to teach you is the major scale. The major scale is an incredibly useful tool for thinking about all other scales. When I'm thinking about playing any scale, I'm usually thinking of how it's different than the major scale. So maybe it's missing some notes entirely, maybe some notes are flat or sharp. The major scale which is called Balawal in uh, Hindustani Sangeet, the classical music of northern India. It is a seven note scale, so it's heptatonic, so it's Sa, Re, Ga, Ma, Pa, Da, Ni, and then to the top of the octave back at Sa. Sa, Re, Ga, Ma, Pa, Da, Ni, Sa. And then coming down, straight down, Sa, Ni, Da, Pa, Ma, Ga, Re, Sa. Sa, three holes down. Re, two holes down. Ga, Ma. Note that Ma is partially closed. Pa. Remember that paw conceptually is all six holes closed, but for this middle paw, you actually keep that finger up or partly closed just so that it sounds better. But think of it as all six holes closed. And then da. Ni. And then back to sa. If you're wondering how I'm making it sound different than then go check out my video all about gummocks, G-A-M-A-K-S, and you'll learn how to make all your notes sound a lot better. But back to the topic at hand, the major scale, Sa, Re, Ga, Ma, Pa, Da, Ni, Sa. So it's Sa is always the tonic, the first note of the scale is always called Sa. Second note, Re, it's Should, Re, the natural second. Third note, Should, Ga, the natural third, and then Should, Ma the natural fourth, and then pa, the fifth, should da, which is the sixth, should ni, which is the seventh, and then back to sa. Now that you know this system, I'll always be able to tell you how to play a certain scale just by saying things like, make the third flat. 
So the third, as I said, is your should ga. Should means pure, that's the natural note, it's not the sharp or the flat. So if I say make the third flat, then you know to take your third, which is ga, and make it komal ga. Komal is flat. So instead of we can make the third flat. and play everything else the same. If I said make the third flat and make the sixth flat, then... Then we'd be playing Kirwani. Sa, Re, Komal, Ga, Ma, Pa, Komal, Da, Ni, Sa. If I said make the third flat, make the sixth flat, and make the seventh flat, then we would play Sa, Re, Komal, Ga, that's your flat Ga, Shid, Ma, Pa, Komal, Da, that's your flat sixth, Komal, Ni, your flat seventh, and then to the top of the octave at Sa. And that would sound like this. Flat third, sixth, and seventh. That's the minor scale. A savri top in Indian name. Uh, and let's see. So, another thing I may say at some future lesson is play a sharp fourth. That's your Tivra Ma, the sharp Ma, all holes open. Because Shud Ma, the pure Ma, is there. Sa, Re, Ga, Ma. Should ma, but if I say make it a tiver ma, the sharp fourth, then it's everything open. Disregard this finger I had down that wasn't supposed to be down. Should ma is like that, tiver ma is like that, sharp fourth. So if I say take your major scale and just make a sharp fourth, then you play. which is called Kalyan, or the Lydian mode in Western naming system. Now, something else I could say, let's play Bupali. Bupali is a pentatonic scale, five notes. But the major scale, Balawal has seven notes, so we're going to have to drop two notes out. So what I'd say is play a major scale but leave out the fourth and leave out the seventh that means don't play ma and don't play ni and what you're left with is sa re ga pa da sa sa da pa ga re sa and I have a couple videos teaching you how to play Bupali so go check them out so here's Bupali no fourth no seventh Hansa Dwani would be no fourth and no sixth, meaning you're going to play sa, re, ga, pa, ni, sa. Sa, re, ga, no fourth, so no ma. Then you play the fifth, pa. You forget the da, the sixth, and you play the seventh. No fourth, no sixth. Sa, re, ga, pa, ni, sa.
What about a six note scale? Janissa Mohini. Janissa Mohini has a first, second, third, fifth, sixth, and a flat seventh. So there's no fourth. And your seventh is flat. Sa, re, ga, pa, da, komo, ni, sa. Okay, so now you know how to play the major scale, and now you'll understand in future videos when I tell you how to play a scale by using a system such that I can just say, hey, make the second flat and don't play the seventh. So then you take your ray, make it como ray, a flat second, and you wouldn't play ni, which is your seventh, and then you'd be left with whatever the scale happens to sound like. I just made that up on the spot. So have fun practicing your major scale. As I said, it's pretty much the basis of music in most places in the world. Even if it's not the scale that's often played, then it's still how you can easily conceptualize playing any other scale, of which there are hundreds or thousands of scales. And it is super important, certainly in Western music, if you listen to pop music, the vast majority of it is in the major scale. If you hear a happy song, it's probably in the major scale, which makes it easy for you to figure out how to play popular songs. So final time. Happy flute playing. My name is Kerry Krieger. Check out my website, IndianFluteMusic.com. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel and leave a comment. Let me know how you like these videos. Thanks. Bye.